plus tournament I've ever been to in Vancouver. Mm -hmm. uh, consistently shows up. Uh, and he makes such cool art. Like, and makes I really cool art. I love yeah. the style. Like He's done a stylized take on every character, uh, all the way for all the new characters. He's just finished the pins for his new collection here. He's got oh. Sora and Kazuya and all those great characters now. You know what else I also love of his? They've, he's got the, the stickers of Kirby's, and it's all the different uh, Kirby alts for when you suck in different characters. Oh my gosh, he's got all the Kirby's. Yeah. So There's a really gosh. cool one with like Kirby, Donkey Kong, and he's got Donkey Kong arms, just massive guns. <laughs> I was playing Ultimate the other day, and I didn't realize uh, Kirby and Hale's Banjo, he gets the backpack. Oh, and that's cool. Kazooie comes out. I, it's love, so I funny. love that. That's so <laughs> funny. I love little backpacks. In Melee, the green Pichu is my favorite with the little Boy Scout backpack and uh, bandana thing. Oh, yeah. Um, and here we go. Sheep here and Flex starting off the game. Yeah, Flex starting with a huge 119% uh, kind of combo string here on the edge guard. Yeah, like Falcon, yeah, he that's gets a dead Falcon there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, he gets the longest combos. Uh, he gets comboed on in the game the longest because you know he's at just returning to stage forever and ever. Mm -hmm. I once saw something on Twitter I thought kind of funny. It was uh, if you ever post, like you, you're never supposed to post a combo against a Captain Falcon. Like combos against Captain Falcon after he loses his double jump, they don't count. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then yeah. I'm just like, ah, dang, that's, <laughs> here goes 50% of all of my best combos. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just make a combo on YouTube, like a combo clip, but it's all just Captain it's Falcon. It's all just Captain Falcon, yeah. <laughs> Speaking of uh, this match, I just saw some disgusting war crime up till uh, earlier where it was like, it was the reverse up tilt, but it still hit the shield. Oh, is and then he turned around up tilt again after, and I was like, uh, and then it hit. That's the, that's the spacey privilege, yeah. You up tilt the wrong way, but then it's a timing mix up, and it actually just works. It actually <laughs> just works, yeah. It's like the hitbox is just huge. Um, yeah, definitely uh, spacey, spacey up tilt is a thing that uh, is annoying to deal with as Kevin Falcon. It covers yeah. your whole body. 100%, yeah. Uh, definitely you're able to, you know, have some drift mix-ups, which make it uh, kind of scary to put out an up tilt as a spacey, but mm. the onus is on you yeah, as it's a like Captain Falcon you gotta to, find to make that a bad choice, right? Yeah, you got to find the in-between to be able to hit that up tilt. And uh, if you don't get it quite perfectly in-between, then you get, like, a fat uh, reversal. The Fox player gets it. All right, so she pair, you know, looking for a, a strong knee somewhere on these uh, knockdowns. Yeah, and that would take the stock. Sort of gaining probably. a footing right here, but uh, you don't want to take too much more percent. This is definitely an uphill battle. Oh yeah, that's gonna be it. Yeah. Flex is doing a really good job of just jumping up nice and high to stuff those Captain Falcon, the high Captain Falcon on these. Mm -hmm. Sheep is just not really having the opportunity to choose between drifting forward on stage or backwards to ledge. He just gets up uh, back here before he gets the opportunity. Mm -hmm. Yeah, with Captain Falcon, you want to be recovering as high as you can 90% of the time, probably, um, mm -hmm. especially just because. You can get air dodge mix-ups if you're up over the ledge as well, and that's like a huge part. That's like 50% of his recovery game, if you ask me. Mm -hmm. um, you don't want to air dodge all the time, like maybe like 30% of the time, but like just having that option and making them think about it is what gives him the recovery status. You know, like that's the extra nuance to the uh, the game coming back. Absolutely. So. Back to Battlefield. Last game was Battlefield 2, right? Yeah, true. Yeah, he took him back. Which I don't think is a bad choice. Uh, as a spacey player myself, the only two characters I stage strike against are Captain Falcon and Sheik, because I don't like to give them Battlefield. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Okay, okay. Sheep hair pulling something out of the trick box here. Oh man. Flex is just ready to tech these knockdowns. Yeah, uh, he absolutely is. Maybe, uh, maybe she oh, could. That was a nice little jab. Just kind of tripping off flex, I'm sure. Um, yeah. Getting sent in one way, all of a sudden, no, actually, you're not going anywhere. I'm just going to jab you. You're going to stay right there. Mm -hmm. Nice edge cancel on the up B there. That's what you need to do. Go high, and then hopefully, you, you know, you get a few more tricks up the sleeve if you go really high. Mm -hmm. I think she pair, uh, you know, more catching flex off guard. That's what you want to get in this matchup. Just in Falcon, with Falcon in general, too. You know, he's very... Uh, Kind of down low tech trappy character. Um, 
you know, everybody talks about the tech chasing, but mm -hmm. he's also very much a tech trap kind so of. So good guy. at it. Between like up air and forward tilt, like mm -hmm. there's a lot of there's a lot of ways that you can do that with Captain Falcon. Yeah, and the nair, like you uh, know. Uh, yeah, nair. If you do single hit nair, all of a sudden you're not teching at all. Yeah, exactly. I'm gonna grab you. And then you know you press the R button, you're like, oh, this was a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, the double D? No, Oh my quite. gosh, Sheep Air goes for it, though. Yup. Okay, back to Nooch. Nooch Magooch. Oh, here we go. Ooh, here we nice go. Up, nice downward angle okay. forward tilt into a Ooh. stomp. Let's go, Sheep Hair. I got worried for a second, but cleaned it up. Did the right option. Absolutely. Oh, and then got, got some combo there. Oh, let's go. 42%. Heck? This is all of a sudden looking very doable for Sheep Air. That was a very bold idea. The, uh... That's a something that I've been seeing a lot of Falcons do now. Uh, Mech, particularly, but I think Nun has been kind of doing it more. Is the uh, the two jabs into an option, not doing a gentleman, just oh, doing yeah. jab oh, one yeah. two, and then you know kind of doing a mix up off of that second so jab. When they expect a gentleman, that's so good. Mm -hmm. I do that because I can't gentleman, and because <laughs> of that, it's bad every time. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I'm come on, I'm trying to mix you up here. Yeah. <laughs> You're not supposed to just do your out of shield. <laughs> what the heck? Um, but yeah, good stuff to flex. Uh, that was some pretty clean, like, what stood out to me most there was just the clean edge guarding. Mm -hmm. You know, they say Captain Falcon has a bad recovery, but we were talking about, you know, edge guard mix ups, drift mix ups. Mm -hmm. uh, he has a lot of ways that you, he can make you mess up the, the edge guard, but flex every single time, getting a nice clean back air, cleaning up the edge guard, mm -hmm. not really letting Sheep Hair live after going off stage, which is super important in this matchup. Yeah, absolutely. I want to say all of the, this character has easier. Not easy recovery. It's all propaganda. They're all basically the same except Puff. Puff gets just to, and Peach gets to you know they just get to come back. But uh, Falcon, Sheik, Marth, even Fox and Falco, if you know how to edge guard them in certain scenarios, like they're pretty much all on the same playing field in terms of recovery. You just don't want to be off stage. You just have to know all of them, though. It's like some people are are pretty good. Yeah, some people are pretty good at uh, edge guarding some characters, but not so much.